if you're here and you don't fuck with me and you're just keeping tabs because I'd like to know I want to know that you're listening to me and if there isn't anyone in here who doesn't fuck with me oh so you're here that's good so I want to talk to you about something (laughs) one fuck you two I have a question why the fuck is this your logic that if someone hates themselves which I don't but if somebody hated themselves one for being black which is an awful thing to be to hate yourself for being black is an awful thing it's horrible um nobody should hate themselves for their skin tone nobody should hate anybody else for their skin tone Now, why the fuck is it your logic to come onto my platform and say, wow, forehead's too big. Why would anyone be attracted to you? I hate you. Uh, What what are other things that people people are saying? Um, God, there's so fucking much. Just go into those comments and look at all the shit that you're saying. There is no way in hell you are putting any thought into what you're doing. You're acting on some weird fucking, some weird primal fucking instinct that I I really don't think that we'll get to the bottom of. Um, the mob of people telling me I'm ugly and telling me my forehead's too big. These people, you, are so insecure about yourself. I think that the truth is, is that you're trying to use my platform so that you can take all of your self-hate and spew it on to me. Because anybody who doesn't have time for that shit, anybody who actually cares about themselves, isn't going to spend time on my platform trying to destroy my self-image. You're trying to make me feel worse. If I was already feeling like shit about myself, you're trying to make me feel worse about how I look. You're taking my features and you're shitting on them. Which are what features? Exactly. I have black hair. I have black skin. I have black features. And you're shitting on them. And I just wanna know where the fuck that logic comes into play. That's what I wanna know. I'm mad. I'm pissed the fuck off. And and this is just this is just the beginning. And I'm I'm str- I'm really fucking stressed out. I'm terrified of the fucking stupidity. I'm so disappointed in you. Not my fans, because my fans know what the fuck's going on. But I'm disappointed. I'm very very fucking disappointed. And, and, God, imagine there's a little girl on my page looking at my, my photos and looking at my videos and my TikToks that I've recently posted, and they're looking at my forehead, okay? And they're saying, wow, her forehead's like mine. She looks like me. How do you think that little girl feels after seeing those, those comments that you're leaving on my post? How do you think she feels? She had no self-hatred to begin with. But now she thinks, hmm, this person has a forehead like mine, therefore I'm ugly and I don't deserve love? Explain that. You're fucking so, so fucking dense. I can't, it frightens me. And I'm finding out that the world that I live in is a bullshit fucked up world. I have beautiful fans who support me, who are kind to me, who use love to combat hate. I have fans like that. But you're not one of those people. You could be. You can change, but you haven't. You are still, you are still doing what the fuck you did five minutes ago when you left the post on my notified fucking Instagram post, which you stayed notified on. Why? Why? 
Think about that. Disgusting. I'm disappointed and I'm fucking disgusted. I'm so upset. Just wanted to let you know. My fans know how the fuck I feel. They know how the fuck I feel because they feel just like me. But I just want to let you know that I think the way that you guys go about shit is so unthoughtful. There is no sense of humanity in the way that you guys approach a situation like this. Fuck you. A big fuck you to all those people. And you can keep trying to spin shit and you can keep trying to to make me look like I'm a bad person, like I have it out for people, like I'm hateful towards people, like I'm (laughs) a bad person, but I'm not. And I think that it's such a waste of time in a time where there are people who are suffering and there's shit going on in the world that you need to clock. You're sitting on my fucking comments on Instagram and telling me you're ugly and that you're a, that I'm a white supremacist. If I went out into a crowd of white supremacists, what do you think would happen to me? Think about that shit. Because I had just realized how fucking stupid that narrative is. I just realized that. The things, the verbal harassment, the physical harassment that I could go through being in a crowd of white supremacists who you think I'm so good friends with. It's fucking ridiculous. My friends aren't fucking racist on the chat room. My friends on Tiny Chat are not fucking white supremacists. They love me. I love them. They're loving. And that's it. And you won't find anything on them because you're fucking stupid. Your actions are stupid. You may not be stupid. You may, you may be smart. But your actions are not telling. They're, they're just not. They're not it, that's, this just is what it is. You guys are fucking disappointing. This isn't how you combat problems. And if you think it is, then you need to grow the fuck up. And I'm sorry. Not sorry for... By the way. <laughs> we, we can talk about that. We'll get into that. But um, I'm sorry that you, you, you suck right now. And that's all I have to say. Think about what you do. Think about what you say before you fucking say it. And I know you could say the same for me. Oh, why did you say hard R N? One, I was saying it to a white person in the room who was attacking me. Um, And you can see it for yourself. It's on on film. Um, You won't find anything of me being racist because I haven't been racist. Uh, And I'm well aware that I'm recorded in chat rooms. But I just wanted you guys to know, for my fans, if you felt disappointed or embarrassed, uh, I, I'm sorry. And it is disappointing, you know, to, to think, I mean, it, to be honest, it, it took me a while to, to, you know what I mean? To understand what the fuck was going on. And, you know, there's young fans who look at me and think like, oh, If she's saying this word, then maybe I should be saying it too. No. No. You should not be saying that word, period. And that's what I'm sorry for. Is for saying something that is offensive. And and my young fans who would take after me could possibly say that. You should not be saying that. Um, But they're smart and they know better. 
I, I'm really, I'm done here, and this shit's just gonna continue until it doesn't, because people are gonna realize how fucking stupid this all is, and I just, I just wanted to jump on live and let you know, I'm not happy about this, this shit is, is, I'm pissed off, I'm really angry, I'm very, very fucking angry. Not trying to act like I'm not. Not trying to act like things need to be forgotten. Because I don't give a fuck to somebody who didn't like me in the first place. You know what I mean? You didn't like me to begin with. Not everyone's going to like me. I accepted that. I have every reason to be pissed the fuck off. Trust me. Every reason. I I just... The internet is part of my life. I spend time on it. And when I go on there and it's toxic and it's disgusting and people are coming for my looks, things that I can't change about myself, that's so fucking low of you. And you know it is. And you need to learn that. And you could brush that shit off and act like it doesn't matter. But there's somebody out there who looks up to me and you saying I'm ugly and I look and that person looks like me. Little girls who look like me are going to think they're ugly. So therefore, you don't give a fuck about black people. First and foremost, you don't. Don't act like you do. Stop trying to use my platform to make it seem like you're some sort of fucking hero because you're not a hero. You're fucked up. Something something is going on with you. Not me. I think I'm cute as fuck. Sometimes I look fucked up. Sometimes I look busted. That's fine. I accept that. But sometimes I look bomb as fuck. I think I look kind of cute right now. I look a little busted. I'll probably use a brush or something. But that's none of your fucking business. About how I feel about myself. There's no way I can even prove to you that I that I think I'm beautiful. I can just tell you that I think I'm beautiful. So for you to even make that part of some sort of, God, some sort of fucking narrative is so stupid. So fucking low. So low. You are hurting people with the way you, you, the way that you guys are going about this shit is you're hurting people. Why the fuck is this logic to hurt people? someone and hurt young people who look up to me to combat something that you think is going on motherfuckers think that i hate myself you don't know that i hate myself because only i know what the fuck i think it's a real fucking gray area and there's no way to prove it so what the fuck is going on you don't like me That's what's going on. And you don't have.